today we're going to be looking at menus, saving, and rebooting. It'll boot up to uh, this mixer control panel, uh, which you may or may not be familiar with, but up on the upper left-hand side is your menu system. So as you can see, it's nicely laid out here. So as you can see, when we go through some of the menus here, um, for example, an aux bus, we can click on the upper, on the upper section and we can see that aux bus power, uh, pulls out some of the sub menus that also show up within um, aux buses that you would normally see when you're configuring your aux buses. For example, if I need to configure um, my LED wall, for example, this set source, set tally, and rename also appears in this aux bus sub menu. Um, so that's a little uh, dance around with some of the menu systems. The other neat trick is by com pressing command tab, you can also switch between your different menu sets. So I can quickly on the fly go between my aux bus configuration and my mixer control. Now, Kairos is broken down into two separate kinds of files, one of which is environment file and the other is your production file. Environment file um, manages configuration for you know, your, your show's overall frame rate, um, your SMPTE 2110 sends and receives, and um, some of your streams, etc. So that really handles a lot of the setup elements of your system. So say your multi-viewer resolution, etc., system frequency, and whatnot. Um, you know, input settings, all that's going to be saved within uh, your environment file, and this gets saved in uh, save uh, settings, uh, export environment file. So it's an export import kind of functionality there. Now, um, when it comes to production, that is sort of your more traditional, like I've built up the show, I have my multi viewers, I have my scenes. Those are sort of the things that I'm going to have to recall for the next show or the next time that this show comes back in my studio. Um, that's simply just a save as file. Now, say you see an issue with your, your system, right? About every 30 days or so, you should consider rebooting your system if it's under heavy use or if it's been idle. The only way to do that actually is go to System Settings, System, and Reboot. And then it's gonna prompt you, are you sure? And yes, I would like to do so at this time. And while that's rebooting, I'd just like to thank you very much for joining us on this Kairos 101 tutorial.